Ah, uh, no, no. It's going to be a beautiful day. <laughs> oh, no. The prince is taking a longer time in coming down. Uh, Hello. Today is his special day, so he needs to take his time to dress up. <laughs> exactly. Uh, Lolo is right. We just have to wait a little bit. He's going to be with us any time from now. Good. <clears throat> <sighs> Congratulations, son. Happy birthday, my son. The jewel of Upporo Kingdom. My prince. Today is your day. And we are here to celebrate with you. I want you to do the needful. Step forward and cut the cake. Let the celebration start. Yes, son. Go ahead. I Thank will you. stand inside you. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Uh, yeah. What about the other elders in the council? Oh, they are on their way. They will soon be here. Yes. Don't worry. Don't worry. Thank you. Let's go. I'm a little bit. I'm a little bit. I'm a little bit. I'm Stop this, How? What do you mean? Coffee? What is the meaning of this? Coffee in my palace. Open it. I say open it! I know this is you and your mom's handwork. You people desperately want me dead so that you can become the next king. But breaking news, I will not die. Rather, you and your mom will be the one buried in this castle. He said, 
I didn't bring this into this palace. I didn't plant this! So who did? Why is everyone looking at me like this? You and your mom did. For God's sake, we did not! Stop right now! Alright? Why is everyone looking at me like this? I didn't do this! I didn't bring this into this palace! Can you swear that you know nothing about this? Swear with what? Can you swear that you know nothing about this? Swear with swear. what exactly? Enough! Son, enough. Enough. Close it. Close this thing. Take it to Ezemor. Carry this thing to Ezemor and tell him to see me immediately. It's an order. Go ahead! Join him! Good! Coffin to my palace. Coffin to my palace. My prince, your father up there is not happy at all. Very angry. But I said, let me come down here and talk to you as a son. Tell me the truth. What do you know about that castle? You must be mad! Mentally deranged to ask me that useless question! You poured me a drink. Don't know who of this kingdom. You poured me a drink. To hell with the goddamn Uno. To hell with you! My prince, you must try your best to calm down. Grandpa, are you telling me to calm down? Don't you know the meaning of that? Francis made a death threat on my life and you are asking me to calm down, Grandpa. Yes, he is a fool to have made such kind of mistake by threatening your life. But I assure you one thing, all evil plans his planning against you backfire on you. Papa, do you know the reason Francis keeps making such threats on my son? It's because nothing has been said or done about it. Right. I've heard enough to hear. Like enough is enough. I cannot keep tolerating Francis. His excesses because I want peace. No, it's time to give him exactly what he wants, which is war. He wants war, war he shall get. Yes, it's okay, but let's handle it peacefully. Give it back to him what he wants to give to you. So, Prince Francis, what do you want to tell me? What do you want to tell me? You small boy that I carried on my hand when your mother gave birth to you. Have the audacity and temerity to pour your drink on my face? I oh, know ah. I'm sorry about that. I'm sincerely sorry. The thing is, I was mad angry you. You thought I had something to do with the casket. Why would I have something to do with the casket? Why would I want my brother dead? If I wanted Uzochi dead, I would shoot him point blank. Why beat around the bush? Tell me the truth. So you know nothing about the casket? Oh no, I know nothing about that casket and I will appreciate it if you do not ask me about that again. Okay, I think I believe you. I believe you. 
But one thing is this. You have to put a check on that your anger. It is becoming too much. On a major event. Oh God, we need a wee Why is he still mad? But you know, what does that boy want from you? Eh? What does he want? After disgracing you before the king in the palace there, what does he want again? Apologies. Apologies? That boy failed to understand that it, it is not right for one to bite the finger that pissed off. Uh -huh. He also failed to understand that no matter what romanticism does to the labs, mm. it will always be bigger than the arms. Yeah. What Arant now says, he came to apologize to you. For what? Has he admitted to the fact that he sent a coffee? as a birthday gift to his brother has he admitted it okay mm -hmm. do delay what if he didn't send the casket <clears throat> don't tell him. what if prince francis is innocent of the accusation it's here what if he's the one that sent it uh -huh. eh? sure not you. what are you trying to say are you telling us here that prince francis is innocent when all of us he know that he wants his brother dead so that he can collect his birthright. Uh, uh, Udo Dili, hmm? the cockroach hmm. is never innocent in the court where the hen is the judge. I think he is innocent. Oh no, you too? Yes. Uh, it is true that Prince Francis want to take over the throne from his father, mm -hmm. which is not his. Mm -hmm. But let us not jump into conclusion and come to judgment. Because it's not everything that is bad that comes from the palace comes from Francis. That's you understand? Mm -hmm. You see, uh, truth is bitter, but very hard to swallow. It's been long for your fighting. Oh no! Killing one another. You are leaving us and going. Making jest of one another. Driving down our family name to the moon. It's been long we fighting. Yeah. Instead of loving one another, yeah. we should be a happy family. Instead of fighting one another, been long we fighting. And what is the meaning of that? Don't you know how to walk like a normal human being? Are you blind? People is sick. I want you to know this. I will outlive you and your bastard son. Your plans to eliminate me will never work. I can't go from what you could know. Outlive who? You and your bastard son. <laughs> so, if they ask the living to come out, you that is already a working curse will come out? Talk is cheap, and I'm not here to banter words with him. But with my lips and mouth today's date, I know you orchestrated that casket, but I will bury you and your bastard son in it. But I will tell you. You a coward. That room belongs to my son. I no one will take it from him. Rubbish. Your Highness, I will say this once. Call your precious son to order. Let today be the very last day he will stop me and spout nonsense before me. Since he doesn't have respect, let him not force me into teaching him one in a very hard way. 
Respect, you said? Oh, respect. Talking about respect. So this is the way you respect your husband. The king, by talking harshly in his presence. After staying away for so long. That's your definition of respect, huh? I'm sorry, your highness. I, I, just... I, I do not want to. Be. It's okay. I do not want to listen to anything. I am not in the mood to listen to anything. Just leave my presence. Please. Mother, you're back. Oh. Oh. Father, you're still thinking of the incident, right? Yes, of course. I need to know who marked my son for death and had the guts to send a threat to me. Me, the elephant, the any gogongo of Mpolo, Agarabachinuzo. Someone has the guts to threaten my son and myself. I must get to the end of this. Alice! Alice! Your Highness, you sent for me. Major. Yes, Your Highness. What happened in the palace while I was away? Did my son do anything? No, Your Highness. But there was a little hiccups. Though we are yet to find out how and where it happened. What happened? Your Highness, I don't know if you remember that today is Prince Kuzonche's birthday. So what? Well, what happened? While we were celebrating it, a casket with Prince Uzochi's picture appeared right at the entrance of the palace. The picture was marked with blood. Well, and everybody was suspecting Prince um, Francis for being responsible. What? Are you saying they accused my son of being diabolic? Who? Who has the audacity to accuse my son, the heir to the throne of the kingdom, of being diabolic? Who? Did my son allow them to push him around? Did he? Your Highness, you speak like you don't know your son. He stood against it. He wanted to fight even on no who. In fact, my queen, he chew drink on Onowu's face. Good. That's wonderful. I'm proud of him. Since they want war in this palace and chose to neglect the right thing because of their guinea, selfish interest, war the jacket. And where's my son? He left the palace immediately after the incident. And the Evelyn, his wife, I've not seen her since I returned. She went to church, Your Highness. I believe she's supposed to be on her way coming back by now. Alright. You may go. I will send for you when I need you. Yes, my friend. Imagine. Imagine. Why is there so much hate? May the good Lord be with you, Sister Evelyn. The days of your sorrows, agony, pains, whatever that is troubling your heart are over. Amen. God will turn the devices of the wicked for your own good. Amen. Is well with your soul. Thank you, Reverend. Thank you so much for blessing me this afternoon, Reverend. I am really grateful. You are welcome, Sister Evelyn. You see, I'm just doing the work of my Father in heaven. I will keep praying for you and the entire royal household. Thank you so much, Reverend. 
peace be with you. Say I be out. Sadly, so much hate to write. Why are they hating? Oh, yeah. Hello. My love, I've been calling your line and you were not answering. I was just calling you to know if I should get food for you. Okay, no problem. <sighs> Onye. Yes, my princess. Please, let me know if you see any food stand. Okay, my princess. I would like to get food for my husband. Alright, ma'am. Adako. Adako. My little family, I'm bringing your food. Hmm. I know you're famished. More than famished. Hey. Thank you so much. Nay. Now tell me. Is the rumor true? Is it true that uh, a casket appeared during the uh, Uzo's cheese uh, birthday party? Is it true? Where did you hear it? Here. I'm not quite where did you hear it? It's everywhere. I came in from the market before I prepared the food. I mean, it is everywhere. And many are saying that it was orchestrated by Prince uh, Francis. Does he want to kill my grandson? Yes. The casket appeared when we were all at the palace. Mm -hmm. And uh, they say that Prince Francis invoked the casket when we were all there. It's not true. Of course, news. Okay, but tell me if it was not Prince Francis, then who else? Who would want Prince Uzochi dead if not Prince Francis? Uh, that is uh, a question we are still trying to find the answer for. Right now, we have not found the answer uh, because the thing that ate the garden egg. The baby is still in the garden egg. Mm -hmm. What? How did you go? Huh? Say I be out. Sad day. So much hurt to write. Why are they hating? Oh, yeah. It's a royal war. Hey, hey! Come back here, boy. Where do you think you're going? Where do you think you're going to reeking of alcohol in my palace? Where have you been all day? <coughs> Where have you been all day? And what business do you have with where I've been all day? Do you have plans to set me up again? You know, the mistake I made was to stay back for that your lousy son's birthday because I was hoping his new age will bring about common sense. But obviously, you are all agents of bad news. I, agent of bad news? Francis! Francis, you don't speak to your father in that manner. Apologize to him right away. Well, mother, you know I love you so much. 
But I'm not going to apologize to Father for telling him the truth. You want to give my bet right to your favorite son? And the best way to go about it was to set me up with a casket. Father, that was a lousy prank. Enough! Enough! Francis, one more word from you again, you will find yourself in the royal cell. Try it! One more word from you! Mother, you heard father. I don't even have strength for more words. Good night, everybody. Warn your son! Warn your son, Alice! Warn him! Your Highness, you are being too harsh on him. Yes, and Francis is also your son. Why are you being so biased with him? Why? Why are you right now? Eh? I'm your husband. I'm not God. I need you. Hold on. I know I'm so satisfied because it's my leg will be But I can't do that right now. I'm indisposed. Are you dumb? Are you deaf? Didn't you hear me the first time? I said I need you right now and you're telling me what I wouldn't be able to do that right now. I can't do that. Please, you have to understand me. Understand what? <laughs> Who, has been Who has been enjoying your honey pot? Who? I, I need a bloody name. Nobody, I'm on my monthly cycle. Please, nobody, nobody. Dogu Agari, I'm here today. A day you promised me I'm going to see, and I'm here today. I'm here to make sure that all those things you asked me to bring, I have brought them. I have the wine, I have the color not, I have the sacrifice, the monthly sacrifice that I always give you. Please protect my family. Anyone that is going to be against my family, crush. Killed individual with your thunder. Agueri. Yes, I know you've never failed me. And I know you will not fail me this part black mission. Agueri. Drink and get power to go and fight my enemies, whatever they are. In the physical and the spiritual. I've given you your sacrifices here. And I'll make sure, Agueri, that you get all those things that I wanted. Nobody can challenge you, Agori. Nobody can challenge you. Yes, nobody. Agori. The color not is there. I bring the sacrifice. On the Oh, yeah. I fought. What? Do go, go, go. Yeah, I'm going to go. I'm going to go. I'm going to go. I'm going to go. <clears throat> drink, drink. <clears throat> Nobody will challenge you, a girl. Nobody has ever challenged you. Really? Do go. Do what I've just said. Do what I've just said. This is my usual monthly sacrifice that I give to you. A girl, you've never failed. I know you're not going to fail. 
Yes. Look at me. Pretty look at you. Hmm. Ah, come on, you are weak. Yes, I am. What did Aguere say to us today? Oh, I have not gotten any response yet. You can see I'm just sacrificing the thing I'm supposed to do every month. So, you can just say it. Okay. Let me go and wait now. I thought you were ready so that I will use it and prepare your delicious open salad. Don't worry. Don't worry. Very soon. Don't worry. Very, very soon. I'll do it. you're done, I'll come back. Yes. 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 Agori. 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 Fast has opened the door. Um, Mom, if you're here to talk about me, then I'm sorry, I'm not interested. Actually, I'm here to talk about your father, not her. Francis, I want you to go to your father and apologize to him. For what you did yesterday. Apologize for what exactly? When they all tagged me a witch, and you want me to go back and apologize to him? Hell no, I'm not doing that. Francis, you threw drink on your mom. In your father's presence. And they threw me home. That alone is enough to fetch you royal punishment. Now I want you to go to him and apologize. Let's go. Francis, what are you doing here in my presence? Pardon, sir. I realize what a fool I am for behaving the way I did before you and the royal cabinet. Although I have apologized to you know, but I'm yet to apologize to you, my king, and also my father. I'm truly sorry, father. I have forgiven you. Thank you very much, Father. I know you did not send the caskets, but your action yesterday was, was out of hand. In fact, I planned punishing you today according to the royal laws, but for your repentance. I have forgiven you. And uh, I have withdrawn my anger against you. Yeah. It's been long we are fighting, killing one another, yeah. making jest of one another, dragging down our family name to the moon. It's been long we fighting, yeah. instead of loving one another. Open the gates! Girika! Girika, you mad! How dare you throw this trash on me? Girika! Mom, can you imagine Girika threw this on me? What? Is she mad? Of course she's mad! Give her a dirty slap! Yeah, I'm so sorry. It's so mad! How dare you throw this on me? What the hell is wrong with you? Chris, I just apologize. This wasn't intentional. I swear to God, if I hear him, I will disfigure you that your husband will not even recognize you again. Oh! You want to stain my steels so that you and your husband can take the throne away from me? Much. Not from me. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. <laughs> Shut the fuck up! Mother! Shut up! <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
Ginika, uh, what, what is it? Who is after you? Next time she tries such nonsense, beat her left, right, center. Of course I'll do that, mom. No. She can't try this nonsense again. What kind of shit is this? Okay. Why would she want to stain my steeds, mom? Why would she throw this nonsense on me? Trying to stain my beautiful steeds. Yeah. Oh, mom, what are you doing? Mom, what are you doing? What did you run in like that? That's just wanted to beat me because I mistakenly threw a red seed on him. What? Francis wanted to do what? Is he mad or what? Where is he? I want to look at him so that he will tell me why he will raise his freaking hand on you. Is he mad or what? Francis. Francis. He is mad. He must be very mad for doing that. It is you and your generation that are mad. And who are you referring to as daughter in law? This half baked bread? Oh, here she comes out of the hole. Anyway, I don't have your time. I want to see Francis. I want to see him. Let him tell me if he is blind, if he's also stupid. Can't he say this? Is he stupid? Melissa, it's okay. It's enough. Alice, where is your son, Francis? Where is he? I'm sorry, Your Highness. Am I supposed to answer that question? Eh? What? You, his father, has been trying so hard to take away his birthright. When you found out he's not a coward or pushover, you said this thing to blind him. Oh, you think I don't know your plans? You think I don't know your plans? Now, let me shock you. As long as I, Alice, is alive, breathing, your plans will never, ever work. Alice, you talk to me like that? Your son tried to beat this young woman just because she mistakenly threw an orange seed at him. And that is what you're supporting, Alice. That is what you're supporting because he's your son. And where is that, Francis? Where is he? Let him come and tell me the evil spirit that is beating the drum for him. The drum to which he's dancing this evil dance. Where is he? Francis! 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 Did I hear trying to beat? You must be a great liar! Now listen, I personally ask my son to give her a dirty slap to reset her brain. What? Rubbish. Dinika, did you hear her? Is she saying the truth? Did Francis raise his hand on you? Did he slap you? Talk to me! Did Francis slap you? Mother, please let it slide. I'm fine. I'm not in for any problem. Please. Francis must be mad. He must be mad! Oh, he raised his filthy. Where is Mother? Mother! Mother, come here! Imagine Melissa trying me, eh? I don't stupid your God and say Virginia can give me that affair. Rubbish. I don't blame you. I don't what? blame you. Mother, what is it? Imagine Virginia. What's not said? That I have really the what I can take in this place. <laughs> that is my husband setting my daughter-in-law. Melissa, and what is the meaning of this? Yes, you can go to hell and do your worst. I slapped her! I should go to hell yes. and do my worst. Melissa, I don't need to go to hell because. What? Imagine rubbish! I don't believe. 
blame you. I don't blame you. I blame the wife for bringing you to this palace. Mother, I don't blame you. She's gone. gone. Can you imagine? No, it will not end here. It will not end here. It will not end here. Sit down. She's Rubbish. Idiot. You know what just happened? Why the fight? Don't worry yourself, man. At least I was able to stand up to her. By now she will know that this fight is far from over. Mother, you didn't answer my question. What is going on? Why are both of you fighting? Why did I get dragged into this? My dear, you don't have to worry yourself. And there's nothing to tell, nothing. Just to remind you that this palace is in a serious contextual, which you are very, very much aware of. Always be on guard. That's all I can tell you for now. Rubbish. It's been long we are fighting, killing one another, yeah. making jest of one another. This is our offer, Baristana, so you can portray it. Yes, and so? And so? You must be insane to think that my client will listen to this. They are taking full custody of the children and the mansion. 500,000 naira monthly for her upkeep and that of the children. You must be kidding me. <clears throat> Let me tell you something. I'm going to call and visit my clients to give you an outright payment of 5 million. Anything other than that, it's a no-no. Fine. In that case, we have nothing else to discuss. I see you in court. What? But it's not so we can have a deal here in my office. Oh, I see you in court, like I said. I know why you cannot go to court with me, but it's not so. I found something very pretty that can fetch my client more than what she is requesting from me. So, do we end it here or we see in court? You are free to call your client. Paris, yeah. don't you think that your demand was a little outrageous? Relax. Please, all I need is my freedom and that of my children. That man is a beast. He's a devil. Please help me. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Welcome back, my sons. Well, it's okay. My client will take the offer. He will pay her 500000 every month. She can have the house. But my client needs to have access to his children. I believe we are all adults. We are Either you take my offer or we go to court. I wouldn't be a friend. Who do not want to go to court with me? Or do you want to go to court? It's fine. It's okay. Like seriously. I don't believe this. Are you telling me that Francis 
slapped my wife because she mistakenly threw orange seeds on him. Do you know the worst of it all? His mother. That we supported him. Uzochi, you will not allow this to slide. Because if you do, nobody knows his next line of action. Mother, we should be advocating for peace and not this. This feud is not helping this family. Those people don't know what is called peace. And I am going to give them what they wish. Uzochi, you are going to slap Evelyn and Alice. Yes, let them feel that same pain that your wife felt. Francis should come back and tell me why he slapped my wife. I'm waiting. It's not simple. You can just let it slide. You can just let it slide. Someone slapped you in your condition, and you're saying you should let it slide. Like, are you Jesus Christ? Be on my cheek. Yes. We should be a happy family instead of fighting one another. Been long we fighting. Yeah. And why are we fighting? Let's come together. What are you peeping at? What are you peeping at? You lazy gossip bomb. What are you peeping at? <laughs> He's so cute. Mm. Like, who is he? He's dressed like royalty. Whose prince is he? Please just tell me. Gossip me. That's who you are. Who? Cindy, do you have any other thing to do rather than to... Just yes, start talking, please. Just tell me before I roast you up. <laughs> okay, okay. Mm -hmm. I'll tell you. Tell me, tell me, tell me. <laughs> do you remember a few nights back at that bar? Where you conjured me into talking to this handsome... Emotional broken prince who was <laughs> with a sad face trying to drink his life out. <laughs> yes, I can remember. Come on, bad bitch. Did you trace him? Yes. <laughs> you oh. said he turned you down. Yes, he turned me down, but I didn't trace him. So, how then did you meet him? <sighs> okay. That same um, charming prince. Happy hey. to be my savior today. Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay. I forgot my wallet in the office. Oh. I'm going stranded with this food vendor who vowed to frustrate and disgrace her generation, not me. Okay. But that Prince Charming happened to be my rescue. Do you know the best of it all? Okay. He recognized me. Wow. Yes, he did. <laughs> He's now my friend. And we are having a date for tomorrow. Wow, wow, wow. Mm -hmm. That's it, babe. Mm -hmm. I am super proud of you. <sighs> but what of Bernard? Are you really going to bore him? Wow. Bernard, Bernard, Bernard. No. no I'm not going to bore him. I'm thinking of having... Prince Francis as an alternative, okay. like Plan B. Hmm. In case if Bernard decides to be Bernard, just the way he's doing right now, I can just swish. <laughs> no, but you know, on a more serious note, do you know what? Bernard knows that I love him so much. That is why he's misbehaving. But right now that I have Francis by the side, hmm. whatever he wants, I'll give it to him back to back. <laughs> so. <laughs> <laughs> All men do that. Mm. And that's the major reason you don't love them 100%. Yes, so. You love them 80 mm -hmm. and keep the 20 as a spare part of healing and repair. Mm. Mm. <laughs> 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 okay, darling. Um, I hear you. 
Wrecking just of one another Dragging down our family name to the mud It's been long before I did I I am warning you people once again. Anyone that causes any more disquiet in, in, in this palace will incur my wrath. Francis, you have the guts to slap my wife. I swear the next time you try such, I will bury you alive. Zoch, I swear this is not the end. You just awoken the devil in me and I promise you it's going to consume you. It will consume you. Get an Abuja alone. You are nothing but a lousy backing dog. You can never become the king of this land. No peace and no peace. And you can never take my bed right away from me. What is that? Please. 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 What is, all what is all this madness? What has come over both of you? What? No problem. I will tell you that only a fool takes a man's meekness for weakness. Only a fool takes a man's meekness for weakness. We all know that he took him on. So allow him to celebrate this victory. Let's go. It's okay. No! You'll never take my bad track away from me! It's okay. It's okay. Let's go. Run! Run, So much hate to write. Why are they hating? Oh, yeah. It's a royal Yes, right. Right. Yes. 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 I have always been with Francis because he's always aggressive at his school, so she's fine. Mm -hmm. What about his own wife, Evelyn? Mm -hmm. eh? She's safe. It's obvious Prince Francis is hot tempered. Mm -hmm. See? Huh? Nobody say I. Nobody say I did in support of waiting Prince Francis did to Prince Susan's wife. So. God forbid, I am not in support. Why Prince Soji go go attack Prince Francis? Hmm? Instead of him to just close his eye and accept defeat. He now when I attack him, when he knows that Prince Francis know they know they forget past experience. I mean past ugly experience. What will you do? He was picked up like a child. Hmm? Just not make a new Wait, now you they talk this one. Wait, now you they talk this one. When you know, say, Prince Francis, no, they forget. You know, they forgive too. I, I think he's right. Eh? It's obvious uh, Prince Francis has the heart of a devil. <laughs> Let me come down to you. Hmm? Now, if I talk, say, I see you. You go talk, say, I don't talk bad thing. You don't see now. You don't see now that your reasoning is below the standard of maturity. Look, if you want to make your points, don't insult me. What will you do? Be your honor of it. Uh, bah. Okay, bah. Hey, hey, calm down now. That's what to this now. Are we here to deliberate on this one now? Or Prince Francis? Oh, he be so hey, so you can you see that your thinking faculty is very, very low? Yes! It's not by height, though. It's not by fat. It's by brain. Okay. Forget that now, eh? Uh, I know there's no way Uzochi would have stood a chance against you. You must have taken your hand. Are, are you the one saying this, bro? Uzochi cannot stand me for God's sake. He can't stand me on a fair ground. He attacked me while I was coming down from my car. He took me on a west. But don't worry, I told him already. He doesn't know what's coming for him. He doesn't. Tell me, God. Don't stand a chance against you. It's a one on one. It's a one on one. Hmm. You see this fight? <laughs> this is just the beginning. The battle line has been drawn. Uzochi and his mother does not know what's going to hit them. My lord, is there no other way we can resolve this without fighting? You should 
Will you shut your mouth? I know you're a coward, but I'm not a coward. I'm a liar. I'm a fighter. The only way there will be peace in this house is if Father and Uzoji returns the mandates to me. There's no way you steal my bread tribe and expect me to stay quiet about it. I will fight till my last breath. I will fight. Can't you just forget about the throne and channel this energy to becoming more successful? You are a very creative businessman and I'm sure you will make a lot of money more than the throne itself. Please. Evelyn, I understand that you are scared. But this is my son's bet right you are talking about. His bet right. Mom, I don't even know why you're wasting your time explaining yourself to this this dumb child. Eh? Sometimes I wonder where her loyalty lies. My loyalty is with you, my husband. And no. Keep quiet. Francis, say no. We are not here to argue. Please. Go on and take care of us. Make sure you see the family of the I'm fine. I was not attacked by a lion. So much hatred. Why are they hating? Oh, yeah. It's a royal world. I'm good. What is it, babe? I was expecting his call, but it's not him, it's Bernard. So, are you going to take his call or not? He's not going to call after all. Are you not going to take his call or not? Hello. I'm fine, thank you, and you? And let tomorrow come first. Let's see what happens. Okay, I promise. It's all right, fine. Bye. You want to take me out for a date tomorrow? And your friend's charming. Also wants to take you out on a date tomorrow. Yes. But this one is not calling. Do you think he will make it? I don't know. I don't know. Ayalogo, I'm here once more. My heart is full of anger. My enemies are at it again. I want you to move out there with thunder and crush them. Kill them and spill their blood. They are attacking my family. You've never told me, failed me at all, you've never. I am local. I'm sending you on a war, on a mission. You must not come back without fulfilling that mission, I am local. Like a goal is done. Go out and crush my enemies. Crush them in the morning. Crush them in the afternoon and crush them in the night. Let there be wolves and crying over there. Any of them that is planning against my family must die. I am local. They must die. So come back on full mission. Ayalogo, go! Go! Don't come back until you crush my enemies. Crush the bones and spill the blood. Go, Ayalogo! Yes. Evelyn, 
I'm sorry for what happened yesterday. I know I shouldn't have done that. It's fine. Anger makes us do things without reason. You're right. All the same, I'm sorry. It's forgotten. What is the problem? Are you okay? I know you're not in support of the conflict between our husbands. I don't know what is wrong with them. They are brothers but hate each other with great hostility. Is there nothing we can do to bring back peace in this family? If there is, I would gladly take it up. They are always fighting each other and they might end up hurting yourself, only even us instead. I want to talk to your husband. Can you please do the same with my own husband? Yes. I want them to forget about fighting and every other thing. Make him understand that you are not in support of the feud existing between your husband and him. Please do that for me. I'm sure I'll do that. As long as this brings peace to this family and it's end the feud that is going on. Thank you very much. You know where I might find him. You know, let's go and look for him. Sure. Uh, because the fish will arrive this night. Okay. And I need to get this place clean. I remember what you said. Mm -hmm. I, mm -hmm. I was uh, thinking, don't you think I should pay our daughter a visit at the palace and... And do what? And instigate or go there to find the embers of the fire that's really burning the palace? Do you know what I'm talking about? Yeah. <laughs> I'm not going to fan or instigate any, no problems at all. I just want to give her daughter a moral support. She needs to know that her parents are solidly behind her. After all, the true rightfully belongs to her grandson. I won't stop you from going to the palace to see your daughter. But I will not want you to go to the palace and say what is going to bring more problems to the palace. Everybody is angry in the palace. And you know they are all worried about what is going on in the palace. So if you go there, mind what you say. Because everybody is like, I want to keep. Making jest of one another. It's been long we fighting. Remember what I told you earlier. We should be a happy family instead of fighting one another. Been long we fighting. Yeah. And why are we fighting? Yeah. Let's come together as one family. We are I will talk to you later. What is it? My friend, I don't know how to say this, but is there no way you and my husband will come back as brothers? I'm tired of all this. The war, everything. Please, we need peace back to this palace. Please, my prince. You know he's my brother. You also know he's my younger brother. Yes, my prince. I know. Good. Your word is a plot to steal what is rightfully mine as the first child. It's not Uzachi's fault. It's the people and the elders that are pushing him. My prince, let the people's will be done. I'm begging you. What nonsense are you talking about? What nonsense are you talking about? Listen and listen good. If you want peace, you tell your husband to step down for me. I am born to be king and that I shall be. It's been long we are fighting. Killing one another. Yeah. Making jest of one another. Dragging down our family name to the most. Are you saying that my husband's fault? I'm not 
Yeah, maybe. Are you still going out on a date with Ben? Do I have any other wish? I will call him after what I'm doing. Leave that in your dinner. Call him now. Don't lose the stone you have at hand. Why do you think diamond? Call Ben now, my love. Call him. Okay. Mm -hmm. It's not that I'm Keep calling. Who is there? He's coming. Good day, ma'am. Are you Miss Tina or Nepal? Yes, Miss Tina or Nepal. Oh, my God. You have a package, ma'am. I'm good. Have you written your dinner? You sat for me, honey. Thank you so much. Have a nice day. Same thing. Who sent it? Bernard Wright? Let me read the I really can't wait. I'm so happy. I just want to take a little of your time. Okay. To remind you that there is a fact. Out there, that loves and misses you. Mm. I'm sorry for not calling, <laughs> but it is okay for you to call back after whatever you do, you still call. My dinner date of that is still happening. If you still want to. <laughs> wow, that's super romantic. So happy for you. <laughs> you really need to. Thank you. I just received the first thing you sent to me. Thank you so much. Yes, I like it. Okay. Okay, for the new updates. Sit there. Spandle. Alright. See you again. Alright. I love this! I can't believe this is happening! Can I take a look? Oh, I'm going to take a look at Prince Susoshi. Please, is there no way you and my husband can stop fighting and end the dispute between you both? I wonder how both of you are going to react when the real enemy approaches. I think you have to rephrase that line because we are not fighting. Rather, your husband is the one fighting me for no just cause. Go like I chose myself. I was chosen by the gods and the people of this land to become king. Your husband is the one dragging it. So please, I'm not fighting him. I know. And 
I also know how much my husband loved the throne. But my friends, you are very industrious. And I know you can do well better in the industry than as a king. I beg you, if you can sit down, leave the throne for him. Because of your husband's selfish interest? No. He should respect the decision of the gods and the will of the people. They chose me. Let me do my work. I can't back off for him, no matter how much he tries. Okay? No peace and no peace. But trust me, I will never fight him. My friends. Greetings, Grandma. Greetings, Grandma. What are you doing with that witch? Grandma, she's not a witch. Anyways, nothing serious. Nothing serious? Where is your mother? She should be upstairs in her room. Should I call her for you? Don't worry. I'll find her myself. Who's up to you? Who's up Welcome, my Thank you very much. Oh no, our people used to say that a neglected wind always becomes a forest. But don't you think that we are giving Prince Francis too much freedom, and that is making him disrespect the throne? Even when he knows that um, the tradition does not favor him to be the king. Yes, I um, know you very well that he's fighting an infertile battle. And there's no way he is going to become the king. And um, you still don't think that the earlier we begin to call him to order, the better for all of us. Oh no, I think Konoche uh, is right. You see, the stories that emanate from the palace daily, ah, it's enough to challenge with the royal cabinet to do something and not just fold our hands and look. Okay, uh, are you people suggesting we call for another anonymous meeting? Mm -hmm. Yes or no? We need to stop this fire before it boils all of us. It's been long we are fighting okay. In that case Killing one another yeah. Making jest of one another Dragging down our family name to I will get back to you That girl even Has the nerves to make such demand from you It wasn't a demand If it wasn't a demand how dare does she ask you to step down? To step down for her husband? Ah. I asked you what you were discussing with her and you said nothing. That's because men don't talk too much. She wasn't demanding. She was just pleading for the sake of peace. Peace? You said peace? If she wants peace, let her tell her husband to step down for you. He shouldn't drag what is not his. You see that throne? That throne was ordained to you by the gods and people of our land. And you? I heard you went to Prince uh, Francis. Yes. Mother. I believe if there is a chance for peace, I'll give it a shot. I'm doing this for myself and for my unborn child. Mom, please. I don't want to have this child in a house filled with enemies. Please, mm. mother. How can you do such a thing? Don't you know that your husband is the future king of the whole kingdom and you his queen? How then do you belittle yourself to go and kneel begging Prince Francis? No, no, no. Brahma, please understand me. And I'm still repeating myself. 
I'm doing this for my unborn child. I can't risk it. Do you know how I feel every day? Watching everybody fighting over the throne. Mother, please. Consider my condition. Consider my child. Please, mother. Mm. I'm doing everything because of my unborn child. Please, mother. Hey. Hi. 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 Actually, you want to enjoy, but get nature, some okay. fresh air. Go yes, go ahead. Cheers. Cheers. Welcome to the house. <laughs> Thank you very much. Oh. Do you like it? Oh, nice wine. Thank you. Yeah. So, how is life? Life is beautiful as it's supposed to be. <laughs> huh? <laughs> I'm so happy to see you in my house today. Same where? It feels good to come pay you a visit. Huh? <laughs> You're welcome. <laughs> You're beautiful. Yeah. Very beautiful. Thank you. Huh? <laughs> You're cute. Huh? Cute. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> ah. Beautiful weather. Yeah, so... Um. My princess. Her Highness said I should call you. Misha. Is there a problem? No. I don't know. Where is she? Come on, show me. Your Highness, Evan, you went to see Uzoch knowing fully well that he is your husband's enemy. Your Highness, Uzoch is not my husband's enemy. They are brothers. Are you stupid? Uzochi is no child of mine. So stop referring him as my son's brother. But your highness, they are both brothers because they came out from the same loans. I will not have you spy on my son. Why marriage? Hmm. Let today be the very last time you will try such innocence. Because if you do, I will not forgive you. Your Highness, I'm done with you. I'm sorry, Your Highness. I said you are free to go with my son. It's been long we are fighting. Killing one another, yeah. Making jest of one another, dragging down our family name to the moon. It's been long we fighting, yeah. Instead of loving one another, yeah. We should be a happy family. Instead of fighting one another, been long we fighting, yeah. And why are we fighting? Yeah. 
Let's come together as one family we are. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Cause together we are strong. And divided we will fall. So why don't we come together and live in peace and harmony? Yeah. Cause together we are strong. And divided we fall. Let us live in peace like one big happy family. of one another dragging down our family name to the moon it's been long we've fighting me a state of loving one another ah. welcome your idols we should be a happy family thank you very much <laughs> yeah. thank you very much i'm hungry I want a busu soup and garin. All right, my love. Yeah. When you're set, you bring it to my chambers. I have something to discuss with George. Huh? Good. How have you been? I'm good, are you? I'm fine. How is your wife? Mm, she's fine. She asked about you the other day. Was it not on Sunday? Yeah, on Sunday. I think she's missing you. And she don't want to come and see me. No, she's fine. I will be for asking. Yeah, come on, visit me. It's been long we are fighting. Killing one another. Yeah. Making jest of one another. Dragging down our family name to the moon. It's been long we fighting. Yeah. Instead of loving one another. We should be a happy family. <laughs> Exactly. It's, it's going to be special, mm -hmm. you know. It has to be big. I want, I want to make everybody proud. I want to make my father proud. I want to make this kingdom proud, and I want to make this country proud. Yeah, where's <laughs> my brain? <laughs> well, my brain, eh? my the brother has the two minds. You have anger issues. Anger issues? No, yeah, it's not good. Anger issues? No, I don't. I'm just a perfectionist. I I like things being done well. All right. <clears throat> I like it when people know exactly what to do, when to do it, and how to do it. You get? It? Yeah. I don't want to. I don't like it when people get reminded of what to do. You must. You should know. What to do and when to do it. You see, that's just my problem. It's not like I'm <laughs> one angry man <laughs> who gets angry all the time, man. <laughs> this, I, I'm not. Um, I don't have. Why is my wife? She's still busy behind us. Busy with what? Busy with what exactly? That she asks you to sell me my food? What insult! Now you go there and ask her to make herself available. Now! Get out! My friends, my friends, take it easy with her now. She's just a server that, 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 that follow orders. Judge, between my wife and I, who's supposed to wipe the tail in this palace? You, of course. But she's your wife, so she, she's sharing what, what, what power with you. No. How? You're wrong, George. My wife does not possess equal powers with me. I am the prince, for God's sake. She's supposed to be submissive to me. That is her duties as an African woman. Not the other way around. You're wrong. My prince, see what I'm saying about the anger issue? I do not have anger issues. 
I told you that before, I'm telling you again. I don't have anger issues. My princess! <laughs> Please, please, you have to come with me, please. <laughs> Why are you crying? <laughs> My husband slapped you. Yes. Why? He's so furious that you asked me to save him. And he said he would kill me if you don't come with me, please. You have to come, please. Why? <laughs> please, he's so mad. I don't want to die. Misha, <laughs> stop crying. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm My husband, please, I'm sorry I didn't serve the food myself. I was busy. Ay, Jesus Christ. How dare you? How many times have I warned you never to send those useless servants to serve me my food? How many times? I apologize, yet you slapped me. Did you slap you? Did you open that to get him out to ask me that question? My prince. Are you mad? My prince, you have to calm down now, please. No, no, don't, 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 don't tell me that, George. Don't tell me. This woman disrespects me in this palace. Why would she send a servant to send me instead of herself? You're still standing there. Huh? Will you get out? My friend, please calm down, please. Please calm down. Please. Yes, 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 hey, come back here. Tell those useless maidens to come and clear up the stable. Now! What nonsense! What, what, what freaking nonsense? My friend, see what I'm saying? You have anger issues. My judge, don't tell me that. I don't have anger issues. My prince just laughed here. Yeah. You're, you're, you're queen in, 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 in my presence. Because I hate it when things are not done perfectly. Don't you get it? Then you slapped your wife in my presence. Maybe I should have slapped her behind you. And what excesses are you talking about, father? What have I done? What kind of a man are you to hate your wife? A woman you're supposed to love, care for, and cherish. Huh? I didn't do much, Father. I only disciplined her. Her laziness is becoming something else in this palace. She's at the verge of losing her core values as an African woman. And so you go ahead to hate her? When has hating a woman become disciplined? Was your mother ever disciplined like that? Father, I asked my wife to prepare something for me to eat. But instead, she asked the servants to do that. While she was busy playing with her phones, that alone is an insult to me as the crown prince of this great kingdom. Oh, how foolish you are, boy. How foolish! How so stupid you are! How do you expect the queen to be in the kitchen? When there are so many maids, maidings around here who are on the payroll to do exactly the same job. How? Listen to me. Your excesses must come to an end. Your excesses must be brought to an end. And I'm talking to you not just as your father, but as the king. The king of Nkola Kingdom. Well, the king has no right to tell me how to run my home. Not after plotting to hand over what rightfully belongs to me to another. Excuse me. Oh, really? Really? We shall see who determines what is your right and what is not your right. And no fear. Look at him. So much Why are they hating? Oh, yeah, it's a royal world. Apologies. I should have told you about him. It's all right. I never expected a beauty like you to be without man. 
I'm only disappointed in your taste of man. I'm very sure he learned his lesson. My friends. What is this, Bernard? Why is your nose bleeding? What is it? Talk to me. Cindy, you know I'm not a troublesome person. Cindy, you also know that I love your friend Tina so much. I know all of this. But what happened? Did you fight with anyone? I didn't fight with anybody. See, your friend Tina, her new boyfriend did this to me. Come my nose. And I swear, if the only wrong thing I did was loving Tina, honestly, they will suffer for it. No. Bernard, it's alright. I know what they did was wrong. You don't need to swear for them. But I show you, there must be a little mist up here. Mist up, you say? <sighs> no, Allah. No problem, I'll let it slide. But please, tell Tina that that part she's stolen my lead to destruction. It's okay, just calm down. It's okay, no problem. You see, you don't need to explain to me. I saw Bernard. And he told me everything. My question is, is Prince Francis aware of Bernard? I mean, before now, is he aware of him? I didn't tell him. I didn't know how to tell him. <sighs> what happened today? I'm not sure I'm going to see him again. That is where you got it all wrong. Look, you know how Bernard behaves. And he could have at least knock at the door. Because he knows that you're not staying alone. Okay, now that things has turned out this way, what's the next one? I don't know. I don't know what to do right now. Like I don't know if I should call him, if I shouldn't call him. I just, I'm, I'm confused. I don't know what to do, really. If you and Prince Francis is destined to be together, then you will be together. Trust me. Is still answering? Yes, he's not answering. I've been coming here since last night. He's not taking all this on me before. I don't know. I'm losing him. I'm losing him. I'm going to lose him. Tina, if it's destined for you two to be together, then he will come back for you. As of now, you need to hold up as a superwoman and move on with your life. So, 
What do you think I can do? You can. The one defeated by the start of our generation. You can do this. You got this. It's been long for your fighting. Just relax. Okay? Dragging down our family name to the moon. It's been long we fight it. We should be a happy family. Instead of fighting one another, we know we fight it. Yeah. And why are we fighting? Yeah. Let's come together as one family. We are Because together we are strong. And if I don't be we fall. So why don't we come together and live in peace and harmony? Look at this now, hell! Since you came into this house, I have treated you like my own daughter. If you dare disobey me, if you dare disobey me, you will have me to condemn with the rest of your life in this palace. Of one another, dragging down the family name to the It's been long My heart is, my heart is heavy. My lips cannot utter the words the lines within. Then pray to your Father in heaven. Pray to the Son, and also pray to the Holy Spirit. For the Spirit helps in our infirmities. Okay? For we know not what we might ought to pray, but the Spirit itself make it intercession for us with a groaning which cannot be uttered. Sister Evelyn. Reverend, the palace is no longer safe. My husband fights everyone because of the Troy. His mother, my mother-in-law, supports him. But the Igwe and his cabinet will the throne to Prince Uzashi. I am no longer safe in the palace. My husband is no longer safe because the hatred and the enmity there. But I don't know what to do again. Sister Evelyn. Yes, Reverend. Can I ask you a question? Have you prayed specifically for the palace and the throne? Have you? I guess no. See, Malachi 4. Verses says that God will turn the heart of the father to their children and the heart of the children to their fathers, lest he will come and strike the land with destruction. Sister Evelyn, see, we need to pray. Come, we need to pray for entire loyal household. Okay, stop crying. My father in heaven. We do a miracle work in your family. It's been long we are fighting. This world. Come. One another. Come, my dear. Yeah. Making jest of one another. Dragging down our family name to the moon. It's been long we fighting. Yeah. Instead of loving one another. Yeah. We should be a happy family. Instead of fighting one another, been long we fighting. Yeah, and why are we fighting? Yeah, 
Let's come together as one family we are. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Cause together we are strong. And divide that we will fall. So why don't we come together and live in peace and harmony? Yeah. Cause together we are strong. And divided we fall. Let us live in peace like one big happy family. <laughs> Babe, do you think what you did was right? Ending it with Bernard totally because of Prince Francis. You don't even know much about him, aside from the fact that he is a self acclaimed prince. Same I know I don't know Francis that much. But the truth is that there is this peace, this peace I feel with everyone. That sensation, that sensation. Sensation. I feel whenever I am in Francis, it's something I cannot explain. Only like Bernard. Because Bernard is a good man, respectful and loving. He always puts you first in everything. He may not have enough just like you, but he's always there to make sure you are happy. Those sacrifice means nothing to you. Look, don't let emotion be cloud your sense of judgment. You really need to think this through. I love him. I love Francis. I just wish you could be that friend. Most times, our wishes are what of made of choices. You really need to think this through. You need to. I cannot thank the gods enough for being so merciful. Yes, so you're welcome. The gods are merciful, my darling husband. Indeed. Unlike some wicked and heartless souls who thought my daughter in law will lose her pregnancy just because theirs is a barren land that can never bear any fruit. See that? Mm -hmm. Go upstairs and rest. Do some rest, okay? Okay, mommy. My darling husband. Thank you, darling. Anya Miria Kona, Yo Kona, Anya, Oh Mumwebe It's been long we are fighting Killing one another yeah. Making jest of one another Dragging down our family name to the moon It's been long we fighting yeah. Instead of loving We should be a happy family instead of fighting one another. Been long we fighting, yeah. And why are we fighting? Yeah. 
Let's come together as one family we are. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Cause together we are strong. strong. And divided that we will fall. So why don't we come together and live in peace and harmony? Yeah. Cause together we are strong. Excuse me. This is an emergency. Can I use the car? Just round up, round up. Oh, bro, please. I have an emergency, okay? You can use another car. What nonsense do you mean by that? So I don't understand. What do you mean by you have an emergency? It's not nonsense. Did he not tell you that I'm waiting for this car to be ready? What happened to your own car? My car is faulty, okay? And so fucking what? No cause for alarm. I'm just pleading. Let me use yours. I'll be right back, okay? I have an emergency, please. Don't try that nonsense. Don't try that nonsense with me. I'm coming, okay? Let me have the car keys. Wrap up now. Why are you acting dumb? Please, I'm coming. Oh, eh? What's the problem? Are you there? Hand that you over to me now. I said, ha! Are you saying? Don't get me angry. Hey, don't get me angry. I shouldn't get you angry. Is it those? Is, 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 is that what you're telling me? What's your problem? This guy! I, 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 I,